Hi guys, David and David here from payit4.com. Welcome to episode three of Come On Apple. And today we're talking about iOS. If you have an iPhone, iPad, or iPod, you can't really downgrade your iOS version. Right, and this wouldn't be a big deal except for the fact that it has a very negative impact on people's ability to use their devices and get the most out of them. So here we have an iPad, fourth generation, beautiful condition. It was top of the line and it used to fly. So now I've upgraded to iOS 10 and I'm just gonna do a few things to demonstrate my point. So let's just open a new tab in Safari here and we're just gonna go to maybe ESPN.com. Let's see how this works. So ESPN is loading, still loading. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Still loading. Still loading. So let's just open another app. Maybe we'll go to the iBooks. First. iBooks. Let's try, is it opening? <laughs> is it, you can't even tell what's opening. It's that so slow. like what's going on here? Nothing. iBooks, very slow. Like, okay, finally loaded. Let's take a note. We'll just do some typing here. This is great. Oh, my notes. There is nothing wrong with this iPad. This is a great iPad. So like if I'm just, even if I just want to type a couple of things, like, hey, let's go to the, I mean, what's going I mean, on this here? Is, this is painful. This is like, this like, is painful to watch. What's happening here on, the, you know, it's like, what the hell, you know, seriously. Come on, Apple. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah. So this iPad was in perfect condition. It used to fly, like I said. Yep. And so a lot of people talk about um, planned obsolescence. And they accuse these hardware companies and phone manufacturers of designing products that are just going to break after a couple of years. Well, this product is never going to break. Right. That thing is a break. Right. If you had a million of these, you could build a tower. Absolutely. So this is never going to break. But what they do is they upgrade the software and they make it bloated. So it slows down and it slows down and it slows down slowly. I think this came with iOS 6 or 7. Right. And then I upgraded to iOS 8. It got a little bit slower. And then 9, it got a little bit slower. And then 10. And it, now it's just like right. unusable. Now I have, I have an iPad, one of the newer ones. And I have iOS 10 and mine super fast. Right. So, okay, right. His, his iPad is faster. But this has a fast enough processor in right. it to load the internet very quickly. Like it did back when I got it. My dad at home has the exact same model that I bought for him. And he never upgraded to iOS 9. So he has iOS 8 still. And it flies. And I, was, I watched him use his iPad. I was like, holy, you know, I wish I could go back. So I just want it to be the way it was when I took it out of the box. And this is one of those things Come where on, Apple. this is one of those things where Android might actually have a, an advantage over Apple because oh, yeah. I mean, we just made a video, top 10 reasons why iPhones are better than Androids. Mm -hmm. But in this case, we think Androids might actually be better because if you have an Android phone, you can downgrade your version I mean, of software. Come on. come on, Apple. I just want to be able to put the version of the software on this thing that came with it because otherwise now I have to spend another $400, $500 right. to get a new and iPad. That, that's really one of the problems that you got this iPad, you know, three years later, is it still going to work? Right. And I mean, I, I just, it's just silly. It's actually frustrating for me because I used to use my iPad all the time. I don't use it because it's so slow now and right. I don't really want to drop 500 bucks on a new iPad. So if you're running, if you have like an old iPad or an old iPhone, like sometimes this is the sometimes reason it's not better. to yeah, just don't even, it's super old. Right. Right. So thank you for watching this episode of Come On Apple. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome iPhone videos. Thanks for watching.